He sounded fine. She sounded like she was okay and she was coming back to school. But this Cheatham County student athlete did not return to school. Investigators say she killed herself while in sheriff's custody. Happening now, investigators are examining the minutes surrounding 16-year-old Mindy Llewellyn's suicide inside a holding cell in Cheatham County's courthouse. News 2's Joseph Pleasant went looking for answers. It's just total shock. We just talked to her the night before and she said she was coming to school the next day. And then she wasn't there. Amber Yarbrough is still stunned by the news her friend Mindy Llewellyn is gone. The 16-year-old junior at Harpeth High School hung herself in a holding cell inside Cheatham County's courthouse on Monday. Cheatham County Sheriff would not comment about Llewellyn's death. The TBI has taken over the investigation. According to the TBI, deputies were waiting for youth services to pick up the team. She was in custody after running away from home. Llewellyn was popular and an accomplished athlete. She placed fifth at the state golfing championship in the fall. Even if she wasn't okay, she was more worried about you. She was always nice to anyone she came in contact with, whether they were nice back or not. But Llewellyn did speak out on her blog. In a post one week ago, she wrote, I'm ready to die. I could use a break from this body and never come back. Yeah, they say, you know, still waters run deep. Mindy was someone who had very deep thoughts and uh, she was very thought out. Aaron Johnson is the youth minister at Pegram Church of Christ, where Llewellyn was active with the youth group. Everything sounded great and she was talking about doing things in the weekend and and, uh, you know, it's just something that you're right. It was a very big shock to a lot of them. Cheatham County schools are investigating if the teen was harassed at school. So far, the director told me there's no evidence of bullying. Meanwhile, her friends are still trying to accept that Llewellyn is gone as her family now plans her funeral. In Cheatham County, Joseph Pleasant, Nashville's News 2. The TBI did not say how long its investigation will take. We will update you when we 